What's up guys? I'm going to show you how to do the unrevoked forever root. Now, uh, before you can do this, you actually have to have your phone rooted with unrevoked 3. Um, if you look in my videos, it actually is a video, it's going to be called Droid Incredible Root, and that's using the unrevoked 3. You need to do that before you do this. So if you haven't rooted your phone, stop what you're doing now and do that real quick. It's really simple. Um, the, if you have rooted, if you look at these radio bands, these are uh, a series of numbers, you cannot do the unrevoked forever root unless you have one of these four radio bands. The way to check that is of one of two ways. Let's go to the phone. You can actually go into menu, uh, settings, and go down to about phone and it is under software information look for the one that says band uh, baseband ver version let me uh, focus real quick mine is zero point or one point zero zero point zero three point zero four point zero six and that is actually the very first one if you if you do not have the first one um, you cannot do this uh, if you have any of these actually if you have this one as your band version this one this one or this one you can do the unrevoked uh, forever route um, if not you will not be able to um, they're going to be adding support for more radio uh, versions but at this moment it's only those four so uh... Well, let's get started i'm going to provide you with a link um, it's going to be called it's going to be called droid di underscore forever underscore um, root Okay, and the f it's going to be a zip file. You're going to have to uh, unzip it and install it to your uh, desktop. You open it up. There's going to be all of these in there. Um, I'm going to include. This is the actual text from the website. If you need help, just go there, um, and you can actually read it. It's a w uh, Microsoft Windows Office document. Here's the actual um, thing you're going to install. This is the PB31 IMG Clockwork Mod reco uh, Recovery. This is the Stock Recovery. And this is um, their custom uh, Unrevoked custom splash screen, which is the boot screen. Um, and this is the Super User application. Now, you will only want to do the Unrevoked forever. Um, if you want to have forever root and then and still receive the 2.2 update then you're going to want to do the uh, forever root and then you're going to want to flash the stock recovery which is going to be PB31 IMG stock um, and then once you get um, the update you can then you're going to want to do this you're going to want to flash the clockwork mod recovery and then you're going to want to um, put in the super user application which is that that is a super user application so let's get started on this okay I put on my tripod and I zoomed out um, so what we're going to start off with is going to the phone go to your phone uh, plug it in and and you want to insert it as a disk drive. I already have. If you have not, though, you want to put it as a disk drive. Okay. Now, I've already uploaded my uh, SD card. You want to pull up your SD card. Mine's right there. And then you're going to want to uh, click and drag the unrevoked hyphen forever. It's going to be a zip file. Leave it as a zip file and put it on the root of your SD card, meaning not in any folders. Okay, once you do that, you're gonna close 
you're um, gonna close that the your SD card and you can leave this open it doesn't really matter the rest of the things is gonna be everything else is gonna be happening on the phone right now so let's get to a better let me let me zoom in and focus better okay now after you uh, put the unrevoked forever uh, on your SD card what you're going to want to do then is power off your phone just like normal and remember you must be rooted in order to do this with um, unrevoked 3 you must be rooted with this otherwise it's not work okay next thing you want to do is uh, press the volume down and the power button so you get into your bootloader okay once you get into your bootloader, uh, just let it run its quick course. It's going to look for uh, a file it can install. It will not. Then you want to go use your volume rocker switch and go down one to where it says recovery, which should be your second one. It's just going to say recovery. Uh, you want to press your power button to go there. Okay. Now that you're in your um, recovery, your clockwork, uh, go all the way down to where it says install zip from SD card, which from which should be your fifth option down. Oh, sorry. Do not press your power button. I always forget that. Uh, what you want to do is press the optical joystick. That's how you... Uh, you're going to want to press the optical joystick once you get to the install zip from SD card. Then go down to the install zip from SD card using your rocker switch and then press the optical joystick again. Choose zip from SD card. And then your unrevoked for hyphen forever root.zip. Um, for me it's at the very bottom. Uh, depending on where it is, just look for it. It's, it's going to say unrevoked hyphen forever.zip. You're actually going to want to go to that and click the um, optical joystick and go all the way down to where it says yes install unrevoked hyphen forever that's it now uh, um, before I install it I want to let you know something if you install it and anywhere um, in the installation process it will show if there is an E a cap it's a capital E with uh, the two dots next to it that means an error you want to stop right away and uh, reboot your phone or uh, stop just stop the installation okay and there should be none and I'm looking at mine real quick there are none no um, no ease no none of that uh, error so what you want to do now is just press the, your power button to go back one you're going to go to the main menu and it's going to say reboot, reboot system now. And it will re reboot your phone like normal. Now I'm, to see if you uh, have gotten your uh, S off, which is the Android, meaning that you have root no matter what you do, uh, after it reboots, you're going to want to power your phone off again go into your bootloader which is holding the power the volume down and the power button and at the very top it will say either S on or S off and I'll show you right now as soon as my phone reboots completely okay okay now I want to turn off your phone again. You can do battery pull here. It doesn't matter, but I just prefer doing the power switch. <laughs> okay. Okay. Now your phone is completely off. What you want to do is press the volume down and the power button again. Till so uploads. Okay. Now at the very top here, Right here at the very top, there's going to be a second. Okay, at the very top, it's going to say incredible 
it'll, it'll say something like that, and it'll say XC, and it'll say ship, at the ver and right next to it, it'll say S off. That's if it's uh, done the route completely. Let's see if I let me see if I can get this to focus real quick. Okay, I can't get it to focus, but you gotta believe me. Right. It is right there. It'll say S hyphen on or S hyphen off. You want to make sure it says S hyphen off. And you know that you have forever root on there now. Okay? So you can just go to... You want to go to fast boot then? Just to reboot your phone. Go to fast boot and then go to reboot. And it'll just reboot your phone like normal. The next thing you want to do as soon as your phone reboots... If you want to have forever the, you want to be able to root on no matter what update you have, and you want the Froyo, the official Froyo update pushed to your phone, what you're going to want to do then is after your phone reboots, load it in back, load it uh, back in as a disk disk drive, and you're going to want to copy and paste this file.